And I mean, is it because when I look from a perspective of having an Airbnb business, like, I don't know, again, it's for the uh, girls and, and, and boys who are looking to get involved into the business, because I've seen some photos like floating on the Internet. And I know it's like it's just a probably a few percent. But I think it is, is it not too much like is it turnover is not too big? Because I think when people come in and they just rent the, the place for a one, two days, I just feel like they're going to just trash the joint, you know, like, so <laughs> is that happening a lot or, or, you know, like, so is it, is it like a lot of expenses going towards Airbnbs? Like what these uh, homeowners are, are facing? Like, is it a big issue? In, in some cases, yes. Uh, but uh, over time we, we found ways to, to mitigate that. Right. And, and what we found is uh, through Airbnb and, and VBRO on the way, uh, you have house rules and and what happens is uh, guests have to agree to your house rules in order to to rent your place so those house rules in, in a sense become uh, a binding contract and if you you look at it that way then it changes uh, the dynamics in terms of risk mitigation for for things like that so our house rules are very long and robust and and what that allows us to do is uh tell guests uh hey we're, we allow events you can stay one day but you're going to pay for it uh, you're going to have a, a pretty uh, expensive security deposit uh, in order to host that event and then oh by the way if if they're damages uh, we're, we're just going to hold the security deposit and then claim uh file a claim against you so, so having robust uh, house rules uh, plus insurance allows you to to mitigate and offset a lot of a lot of the risk, and then also tied to that uh, security, uh, especially for homes because we deal with a lot of three and four bedroom homes uh, in uh, in our portfolio. So having uh, outdoor security is a uh, is a must so to, together those help mitigate a lot of risk and I, I tell you that i've only had one incident with almost uh 550 or so uh guests over uh over two years one incident where we've had something taken uh from from one of the properties but by and large small accidents with kids uh happen 